Hello folks, it's Driver Films on the Driver Films Shortwave channel and some of you may have noticed on my Facebook page that I hinted that I've got another video and it's something slightly different. It took a few days to arrive and it is finally here. Bowfeng GT3 Mark II and yes it's something different because it is an amateur radio um, to meet around the 70cm band. Don't let me do unboxings, but I'm just going to quickly unbox it. Um, I mean, I, when I hinted on the last video when I did the Morse code trainer, I was going to go for my ham license. Well, I thought I'd get the radio first. I'm not going to transmit on it, it's just for listening purposes until, until I'm legally on the airwaves. So, um, on the side, seeing Sonic ENF 641 wideband receiving coverage. Uh, CTCSS slash DCS scanning TCMF encoded 128 group channel storage emergency alert 60 to 108 MHz FM transceiver yada 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 um, look on the side here now it comes with the radio the antenna 800 milliamp hour lithium ion battery user manual da, 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 da. so that let's um, see if we can get into it <laughs> it's always I don't know what that is it's always the case when you get these I'm trying to do an unboxing video and I can't ah right okay hmm open Back in a second. Well, what a wonderful thing scissors are about them. So, Ooh. okay. What gump have we got in here? So we've got what looks to be, uh, that might be a manual, little CD thingy. So that might be the uh, manual or programming. What's it? The programming cable. Um, got the radio itself. Quite a nice little size. Got the battery, which we'll just uh, plug into the back. I'm going to avoid temptation by actually um, doing that way. Yes, by actually turning it on. Charge it up first. It doesn't look too bad. Fairly positive action on the buttons. Band. Da -da -da -da. Push to talk. Cool. We've got on the side. It will lift the up flap, which actually has got a tag on it. So I presume you put the radio, the mark into that. Little um, a bit of speaker thing. Hmm, don't like the sound of that. That's got a clip on it. Yeah, cables. <laughs> um. Destruction manual. Mm, I'll read through that. Good as I've got underneath here. Let me look it out. And it's all give a gump, so we have plug to charge it up with. Got there. Um, yeah, that'd be the base thing, so yeah. Uh, belt clip, this strip, and a um, weird in here hands free dudes on the flip. Okay, and this must be the antenna. Let's get this out the packaging. So, yeah, basically, um, I didn't really consider getting ham license for ages, then I went on um, Hamsphere and it was alright, I paid for full version but I didn't really use it that much. Then my friend Jordan who does the radio in Northern Ireland, he went for his and I think I thought, and I kept thinking about it and I thought well bugger it, why not. Here's his little uh, antenna. Come on, 
focus. Oh, don't focus, come on. Oh, yeah. Now, uh, saying Sonic 144 slash 430 MHz INF641 antenna. Fairly flexible. And that just uh, screws on. Thus. So, there we go. Let's see if we can get the camera height a bit bigger. There's a bit of a windy thing. There we go. You can tell this is just completely <laughs> random video. So there it is. Bofung GT3 Mark II. So it covers the uh, double check on the box. You can tell I've never done these unboxing videos before. So yeah, it's a two-way radio. Um, upgrade to video frequency IC, upgrade CQ to enhance anti-interference. Ability. Yep, yeah, I'll put all the specs in the description box below. But I'm quite been quite excited. This has uh, arrived. I got it because I won a forty pound Amazon gift voucher, and with the packaging and what have you, this cost me forty two ninety nine. So, te so technically, it's only cost me two ninety nine. <laughs> Looks quite nice. I do like the feel of it. So. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to. Oh, shit. Turn it on. Oh, it's got a flashlight on the top as well. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a good charge up, have a good look for the manual, and then program some frequencies in, etc., and then just have a good listen. I'm not going to do any transmitting. I'm going to be tempted really tempted to do some transmitting but I'm not going to do any transmission stuff until I have my foundation license at least anyway um yeah this is just a random video so um hopefully some more videos will be coming with this soon and I'm going to try and find the local amateur radio club and I'm going to going to get the license done as soon as I can um perhaps by the end of the year I might be licensed so um Hopefully by then you might even hear me on the airwaves. Or just have a load of videos of me trying to contact people. Anyway, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed already, do, please do so. It is free and you'll be up and you'll be notified when the next uh, video becomes available. Thanks for watching and 73s.